I'm going to explain to you why you should put this in pretty much every Python file that you write. So you're going to see this if name equals main block everywhere. And most of the time, people see it and they respond in one of two ways. Either they totally panic because it looks confusing and they think they're not up to the challenge, or they just totally ignore it and use it blindly or don't use it at all. But it's actually really easy to understand. So before I get into the details, the most important thing is that intuitively, all this means is that everything inside this block is only going to run if you run this file directly. And by directly, I mean something like this. So here, I'm directly trying to run the original file, which contains this if name equals main block. And like I said, because I'm trying to run that file directly, everything inside the if name equals main block is going to run. So if I run that now, you'll see it prints hello world, and then it prints this. So if that's me running the file directly, what do I mean if I'm not running it directly? Well, the main example is if I import it from somewhere else. So here I've got another file and I'm going to put it on the right hand side. And what this one does is it imports original file. So it's going to import this file over here. And that means as Python does, when you import something, it's going to run the whole file. But in this case, I'm not running this file directly. And so I'm telling you now that it's not going to run this code inside the if name equals main block. So I ran that, it firstly imported original file, which means it's gonna run the whole file. It runs this line, it checks this, which asks, hey, are you running this file directly? And in this case, I'm not. So this is false and this doesn't run. And so the next thing we see printed is running another file as we saw there. So the main takeaway here, if you don't take away anything else is that if name equals main means run my contents only when the file is run directly. Don't run the if name equals main block when I'm imported. So let's get into a little bit of the details and actually break down what this means. So we've got two things here and we're comparing them with equality. I'm asking if double underscore name double underscore is equal to the string double underscore main double underscore. So this one is obviously a string and this must already be defined somewhere. So double underscore name double underscore, that's a built-in variable provided by Python anytime you run Python code. And what it represents is the name of the file or the module, just the name of the file really, that you're currently running. So if I add in here, print double underscore name, and then run the original file again, you'll see that the name of this module is main. And so what's happened here is that because this is the file which the user has run directly, this is the file which has been executed, then that file is given a special name which is double underscore main double underscore. So what we're saying is check the name of the code which is currently running and if that was the direct file, Python's going to have assigned it to be called the main file. It's the main one that's been run by the user and so it's going to be equal to this string which is why if name equals main really means run the contents if you're running this file directly. So what does double underscore name double underscore look like when I'm not in the main file? Let's go into another file over here and print and then compare the two. So now when I run another file, I see the names of the different things. So in the original file, now, double underscore name is equal to original file, which is the name of this file, the name of this module of code, which I've imported. And in my main file, another file, now name is equal to main there, because that was the file which I ran directly. So now let me build up a more realistic example to highlight why you might actually want to use this in your code. Let's say that I'm building a data processing pipeline and it consists of two steps. Firstly, cleaning the data, and then secondly, processing the data. And then I'm gonna have another file which combines those steps into one. So in this clean data file, I've got a function for cleaning the data. In this process data file, I've got a function for processing the data.
And then finally, in this file, which I've called entire pipeline, I'm going to clean and process the data. It's going to pull in both of those functions, which I've defined, and use each of them in one combined function. Now, here's the interesting part. Sometimes I might want to process the data or clean the data outside of running the entire pipeline. So what I might want to be able to do is just run this file and clean all the data. So if I were to do that, and I would add clean data on the end of here and pass in some data, which I get from somewhere, then I could run that file anytime I just wanted to clean the data. But the problem with putting this here is that now every time I import something from this file, it's also going to run this. Because whenever you import a file in Python, it runs the entire file. And so now in this code, when I run this, it's actually going to call this function twice, not only here, but also when it imports this file, because it's going to run that. And so here you can see, this is exactly the kind of place where I'd want to have an if name equals main block. Because now I've satisfied both of those cases. I can run this file and on its own, if I run it directly, then this block is going to execute and it's going to clean the data. But if I import this file into here, then this clean data is going to have a different double underscore name variable. That's going to be set to clean underscore data. And so this isn't going to run. And I could do the same in the process data as well. So I can have these different files where I can run them independently and they do their own thing. And then I can also import them and they don't do whatever I've put in the if name equals main block. And that could be really useful for helping structure your code and make it usable. So you're going to see this block everywhere and it's really important to understand how it works. So play around with that and make sure you're clear on it.